In this video, I'm going to show you how to add color to a drop down list in Google Sheets. So, this is what I'm going to show. So, I have this drop down list created, and depending on the value that I select in this drop down list, the color changes. So, I'm going to show you how to create a drop down list and then how to add color to this drop down list in conditional formatting so that you can tell the selections apart easier. So first, we actually have to create our drop-down list. And so what you want to do is you want to first select the cell where you want the drop-down list values to appear. And then what you're going to do is go into the top menu and select Data and Data Validation. And now this Data Validation pop-up should appear within your spreadsheet. Now you can create a drop-down list in two different ways. Um, and it's all done by this criteria setting. So you can either do list from a range or list of items. I'm going to choose list of items in this example because it's a little bit easier. So then after you have selected list of items, what you need to do is enter the values that you want users to be able to select from your drop down list. I'm just going to type some color names just to make it easier. So I'm going to go red, comma, so every value that you want them to be able to select in your drop down list, you need to have it separated by a comma. So red, blue, yellow, green. So I'm just going to create a basic drop down list of four options. And these will be the four options in my drop down list. So after you've entered those, you can just select save. And now you should see a drop down list created with the values you've selected. So just for example sake, I'm just going to copy this so that we have three drop down lists. Now, once your drop down list is created, now is the time where we can begin to add the colors to it. And to add the colors to it, we do it through conditional formatting. So I'm going to highlight all of the cells that contain my drop down lists. Then I'm going to go to format and then conditional formatting. So the format rules section is where we're going to set it to highlight depending on our drop down list values. So you want to navigate to this format rule section and we're going to do text contains. And so the first one I'm going to do is text contains red. And then if the text contains red, I'm going to set this fill color to a red color. Then I'm going to select done. And now if I select red in any of these, it should highlight red. So then I'm going to highlight them again, and you can see this is the rule that I created for it. Text contains red in this range. It changes the fill color to red. Now I'm going to add another rule, and I'm going to repeat this whole process. So text contains, I will do oops, blue, and then I'm going to change it to a blue color. Add another rule, text contains green and we're going to do a green color done add another rule text contains yellow and then a yellow color done so now when I select a color from this drop down list you can see that the value highlights to that color so that is how to color a drop down list in Google Sheets. Now there's not a way where you can have the list colored before they make a selection. It only changes to the color after they select the value. But this is useful because when you have a long list of drop down values, it's easier to tell them apart and it makes it a little easier to use. So. That is it for this video. I just wanted to show that because many people know how to create drop down lists, but not many people know that you can actually color code them with conditional formatting. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.